hello students welcome back to my channel in this video i am going to discuss in detail about the estimation of hcl by using standard sodium carbonate solution aim of the experiment is to estimate the amount of hcl present in the given solution apparatus used are burette pipette conical flask volumetric flask and beakers coming to the chemicals required 0.05 molar sodium carbonate solution hcl solution and methyl orange solution is used as the indicator coming to the principle sodium carbonate reacts with hcl which results in the formation of nacl along with the formation of water and carbon dioxide from this principle it is very clear that one mole of sodium carbonate reacts with two moles of hcl so coming to the procedure it involves the estimation of hcl so initially 10 ml of the standard sodium carbonate solution is transferred into 250 ml colgate flask to that one or two drops of the methyl orange indicator is added and the solution is titrated against hcl solution till a pale yellow solution is changed into pale pink color solution and the titration is repeated until two concurrent readings are obtained so coming to the tabulation of the values serial number volume of sodium carbonate solution burette readings initial final and volume of hcl run down so initially the titration is done in order to measure the volume of hcl run down and the same titration will be repeated until two concurrent readings are obtained coming to the formula used in this titration m1 v1 by n1 is equal to m2 v2 by n2 molarity of the sodium carbonate solution m1 is 0.05 molar volume of the sodium carbonate solution v1 is 10 ml number of moles of sodium carbonate is 1 molarity of the hcl is to be determined volume of the hcl solution is 10.2 ml number of moles of hcl n2 is equal to 2 so finally m2 can be determined by using the formula m1 v1 by n1 into n2 by v2 that is 0.05 into 10 by 1 into 2 by 10.2 so finally the molarity of hcl is obtained as 0.098 molar so the amount can be calculated by using the expression amount of the hcl present in the given solution is equal to molarity of hcl into molecular weight of hcl into volume of the problem solution divided by 1000 here the volume of problem solution is 1000 and hence it is equal to 0.098 into 36.5 into 1000 by 1000 and finally it is equal to 3.577 g so the result is the amount of hcl present in the given solution is 3.577 g if you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice